Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today's video is going to be super fun because I'm going to take some trending spring Pinterest outfits and recreate them on my mid-sized body. As always, all the links are down below in that description box and I have a QR code with the outfits linked when I talk about them. So the first outfit very much reminded me of the outfit that I wore in Paris and I feel like I kind of actually wore this same outfit, but let's recreate it. She is wearing a light pair of denim pants and the jeans that I use in this outfit are my new jeans that I got at Mango. I actually purchased these when we were in Paris and I absolutely love these jeans. And this is the color Dirty. It's like their Dirty Wash. And then I just paired it with a white button down shirt. So this is a very easy outfit formula that you can recreate. She is wearing some Adidas Sambas. These are very similar to the Adidas Sambas and I feel like it gives a similar look. So I put these on. You can actually get these off of Amazon as well. And then I added in a black belt and sunglasses. And this is such a an easy look. I did tuck in my shirt with the jeans. I also opted for a more wide leg jean for this look. And I feel like it just gives a casual dressy look. You could wear this look for weekend brunch, casual errands, and it just looks effortlessly chic. And when it comes to outfits, I always like to think of what fragrance I would wear with an outfit. I feel like it really does elevate what you are wearing. And I want to thank Scentbird for sponsoring this part of the video. If you don't know, Scentbird is an amazing online subscription service. And every month you will receive a designer fragrance in the mail, but don't worry, you do get to pick out what fragrance you do receive. And there are hundreds of different kinds of fragrances that you can choose from. And the reason why I like it is because you can also find your favorite designer fragrances from like Gucci, Versace, but they also have indie fragrance brands, which I love. I always love discovering new kinds of scents. They have some of my favorites from Parfums de Marley, Ishio, really amazing brands on the website. And every month you can choose which one you like. It's an amazing way to discover new fragrances without having to purchase the full size bottle, which can range from $150 up to $500. So before you commit to a full size bottle, you can test things out and discover new brands along the way. There's also a fun quiz that you can take that you can kind of narrow down which fragrances you may like. And it comes in this cute packaging. This vial can open up and this is what you actually receive. You do get a bit of fragrance in here. This lasts about 120 sprays. So it's going to last you that full month and they come in these really awesome cases. So the scents that I tried out this month, this is by Room 1015. It's called Cherry Punk and it basically encapsulates everything that I love about a fragrance. It has a nice saffron leather and like warm note to it, but what's different? The top note is cherry. It is a really unique fragrance and I already looked up how much the full size bottle is because I absolutely love this one. And the next fragrance that I tried out is the Commodity Milk Lust fragrance. This scent has cashmere wood, musk, tonka bean, marshmallow, and amber. So it's a nice warm warm, ambery scent. And this size is perfect because you can easily put it in your bag if you're traveling or you want to take it in your purse for work. So on Scentbird, they hooked me up with a coupon code where you can save 55% off your first order. Be a little bit over $8. Use code Dana Perez, which is available in the US and Canada. I have linked all the information of Scentbird in that description box. And let me know down below what is your favorite fragrance? Is there a specific note that you love? So let's get back into those Pinterest outfits. The next kind of outfits we are styling a black maxi dress, which I think is a closet staple. This maxi dress that I'm styling is actually from Amazon and I'm going to feature it in one of my upcoming videos and I already love it. I will say that there are a few Amazon long dresses that I've been loving. This one is so affordable and it can be styled so many different ways. So they just paired again this white button down shirt over the black dress, which I just feel like I would have never thought to do that, but it does give you that extra warmth that you're looking for in springtime. Again, and depending on where you live, it may not be that warm out. So adding in a jacket is still kind of what spring is all about. We still got to wear our jacket. So adding in this long sleeve button down shirt over the black dress, I think it's just a very easy thing to do to make yourself a little bit warmer and it adds a bit more style. I also paired it with some brown shoes, which normally I don't really mix and match like brown and black together. So this was something that I probably would not have done if I wasn't finding the inspiration from this outfit. So I think this looked fabulous together. And then I added in this J Crew bucket bag for a fun spring summery look. Now you could wear this look on vacation as well if you're looking for some vacation inspiration, looking up ways to dress up this really affordable black dress. I love this option. Now another black dress that I do love is this one from Spanx. Now obviously this one 
is a little bit more expensive if you want something that has a bit more of an A-line shape and a dress that has three different inseams. The Sphinx one is also really a great black dress to have, but I did find something similar on Amazon for a fraction of the price. So the next black dress outfit is pairing it with this blue top, which in this photo, I'll tell you really quick, I would not have paired this look together. She's wearing ballet flat, a blue button down, and a cute little bag, and sunglasses. Now, this is just an effortless look. Now, I don't have a shirt in that color. The only like blue button down shirt I have is this one from Express. It is a bit more of like a pop of blue, but we're gonna make it work. Just like the white shirt, this blue top, and I would have never done that combination. I also paired this look with these Amazon ballet flats. They're kind of giving me like a Chanel look. So with the ballet flat, I feel like it just kind of gives this more of a dressy look than the first outfit that I put together. And then she just has a black bag. I use my Polen bag and some sunglasses. So again, you can pair a button down shirt with a black dress and wear it unbuttoned for a casual cool look which I would have never thought to do to be honest and I think it looks really good. I think I do need a light blue button down shirt though because a lot of these looks kind of require this like light blue shirt so that is something on my list because I think the lighter color would look a little bit better just because this one is a bit bold and then this look we are pairing a more kind of like corporate girl sandal outfit with an oversized blazer. Now for the chunky sandals I pair this look with these fun and chunky sandals just because I like how in the photo it looks more chunkier rather than a slim sandal so I paired it with these flats and then I added in this linen blazer and I think it's just a really cool look that I would have never put together so again if you are interested on in finding ways to style things that you already have in your wardrobe type on Pinterest like black dress outfit ideas and you're gonna find a lot of ways to style things that you wouldn't have thought of and you can actually use a lot of things already in your wardrobe. Cute. I actually cannot wait to wear this outfit outside. The next outfit inspiration is we are going to style a striped button down shirt. I picked up this button down shirt from Zara when I was in Paris and I am so excited to style it. I think this is such a classic thing to have in your wardrobe. So for this first look she paired it looks like honestly really wide leg denim pants. So I'm going to use my Abercrombie linen pants for this look. And by the way, I love those linen pants. They come in three different inseams, so they're long enough for me. And she paired it with a lot of brown accessories. I went ahead and went in with my Amazon sandals, which I love. So this right here could be a base for a ton of different outfits. On top of this just white look, you could add in a blazer, a trench coat, denim jacket, a striped shirt, which I'm about to do. And you can literally wear the same top and bottom five days out of the week and just put a different top on. And so I added in this striped shirt and I, I was so ready to go outside because I just love how this outfit looks together. Now with a button up shirt I feel like you can wear a button up but I think it's really interesting to leave it open and have a more casual look with it. So I love it with the pants. This is a perfect spring outfit and if it's still cold where you are of course you can wear a trench coat over the top and just add a bit of a jacket. Now I also loved this image. I know it's giving more summer vibes but let's just try it out. It's basically the same look with some white short. Now I actually opted to style this look with my Amazon skirt, which is so adorable. I am so excited to wear this skirt this spring summer and I actually loved how this looked. Now I was struggling. She buttoned only one button and her shirt is extremely oversized. As you can see it's like behind her short. It also looks like her collars popped. But anyway, I only buttoned in one button and it kind of just looked a little frumpy. I mean, obviously like the shirt's gonna cover the front part of the short. So I just ended up tucking in the top. So I think that kind of showed off the shorts a bit more. Again, you could add your favorite basket bag. I'll link one similar from Amazon as well. Sunglasses and you are ready for a summer look. So not only can you wear this shirt in spring, you can also extend this look for a summery vibe. I love, love, love this striped shirt inspiration. Excited for this one. Another summary look, we have this woman in a blue button down shirt, shorts, sunglasses, and a basket bag. The reason why I'm including this, I know it's a bit more summery, but kind of play around with this look. I also don't have a light blue top, so I'm going to use what I have and I'm going to pair it with this blue top and the shorts I have are a bit of a cream color. So it's going to look similar, but give off the same vibe, which is important if you are finding Pinterest outfits and you don't have the exact, exact items, which you probably won't. You 
can always kind of improvise. And I think how I would have never actually probably put these two together, but I think it turned out so cute. And again, another great outfit that you can in the summertime in spring, instead of shorts, just wear with a pant. And this could be, could be an office-y look, or you can wear this casually over the weekend. All right, this next outfit, we have a slip skirt outfit. Now, slip skirts, in my opinion, for some reason, I find them a little bit challenging to style. So I am trying to get myself to wear my slip skirt more often and more in a casual way. Normally I'll wear my slip skirts for like a dinner or a dressy occasion, but a slip skirt can be a spring summer wardrobe staple. I took my long maxi slip skirt and I paired it with this Amazon tank top. Now this Amazon tank top has that racer back front, which I think is so stylish. And already this look is casual with the rib tank top. I added in my favorite Amazon black sandals and again the only like blue shirt I have is this one she's wearing a lighter one so I think I, I think I just played around with the shirts that I had I'm obsessed with how this looks because I would have never just thought of making this black slip skirt in a casual way so again Pinterest for the win her basket bag has a black trim on it I don't have a black trim bag and I feel like my brown trim bag just didn't match so I just threw in one of my favorite Amazon purses a black one and I think it kind of made it look more seamless and I think I like the black bag better but if you wanted to extend this for a vacation a basket bag would be a really great idea so love this look so cute all right this next look we have a striped top jean she's in Paris because there's a boulangerie behind her and we're going to recreate this look I love it so I started off with these jeans these are the mango jeans that I picked up in in Paris. I love you guys. I love these mango jeans. If you have thick thighs, a big butt, and you want a wide leg jean that isn't tight on your thighs, these are it. Now for sizing, these are the same size and they fit completely different. The darker blue fits larger and longer than this light color. So if you're interested, I'll leave my sizing info. I got them both in a size 12. These just fit a little bit bigger than the other one. So I used this darker denim for this look in a wider leg. And then I paired it with this Amazon long sleeve stripe top. I think this top is actually sold out currently, but hopefully they restock it, but it's so cute. It's off link similar down below as well and already I love it I think a long sleeve striped shirt is a closet staple because this look together in itself is just so adorable I also paired this look with these Amazon shoes perfect for the springtime and I think this look is one of my most spot-on looks and then I added in my oversized J Crew trench coat and I am ready for a spring occasion like I will be repeating this outfit it's not that I wouldn't put it together but sometimes when you see an inspiration image you can easily just just replicate it with what you have in your wardrobe. So I love this look. Let me know down below what you think of this one because it's one of my favorites. I pulled these two looks because they are very similar, but we are going with a linen pant outfit with a white tank top. Now I liked how the girl on the on the end styled this with a striped cardigan over her shoulders because again, it's springtime. It may be colder out and you might need some sweaters and things like that. So I love how she styled this look. So we're gonna like blend these two photos together. Of course, I am going to be pairing this look with my Amazon linen trousers. I am so excited they actually came out with linen trousers this year because they're 100% linen and I love them and they are perfect to recreate this look. I also added in my Amazon tank top. So again, we're starting off with the base that you can build so many looks off of. Now for shoes, I just put on my brown sandals with this. So because it's spring, you could also do like a white sneaker. You could also add a belt if you wanted to, but I think think just makes this outfit go from okay to like oh my gosh is adding in that striped sweater over your shoulders just adding in that sweater over your shoulders it's just giving all of these stylish vibes I'm here for it so if you want to kind of take your outfit from maybe simple to like oh my gosh she is so stylish just throw a sweater over your shoulders I'm telling you just throw a sweater over your shoulders you will look so put together and this striped one I think is just adorable so I loved how she did that in this outfit and I highly recommend you try the same is very much trending this 
spring summer season i have this oversized vest that i got in an amazon set that i use to style for this look so i am going to go with the straight leg bottoms these are from abercrombie these jeans and they are the ultra high-rise 90s straight jean now i got these in a regular length and the regular length on me looks a little bit cropped and i think it's the perfect kind of springtime pant and i added in the vest on top of it and because this vest came in an amazon set i realized that i can use the set and wear them in different occasions. So I love pairing it with the jeans. Instead of those shoes, I just did a black sandal, but of course you could wear a sneaker with this look and it's kind of a cool menswear inspired spring outfit. Again, it's spring. You could add in a blazer on top, add a trench coat and kind of go out for the day. So this is like challenging me. I don't think I would put this look together and I love how this one looks. And our last bits of inspiration, I used all three kind of for my inspo. We have a striped top, a white bottom and a blazer and a rattan bag. So I love how just effortless this looks. I think stripes is just where it's at. So for this look, I kind of just went with the inspo and kind of made it my own. I added in my Amazon jeans that are a bit cropped and I paired it with this striped top again from Amazon. I'm wearing it right now. Can't really see it, but I love this top. It's so, so cute. It fits amazing. It's flattering. It looks expensive and high end. Like it's giving all the vibes. So that's what I used to create a base of this outfit. It. So I think this striped tank and any bottom honestly just look put together. But don't forget about those accessories. Add in a belt, add in that shoe, and I added in just a black blazer on top to be as my overcoat. And I love how this looks. There's so many unique ways that you can use what you have and mix it up. So I challenge you to take something that you've always wanted to wear in your closet and wear it differently tomorrow. Challenge accepted. Let's go. Let's actually take something and challenge yourself to make something together. I would love to see photos too. If you want to tag me in on Instagram, if you try this trend, I would love to see it. Just tag Dana Perez and I would love to see you challenging yourself to wear something new. All right, so there goes all of these spring outfits. This was so fun to put together. Let me know down below if you enjoyed this video and if you want to see more outfit videos on the channel. Thanks again to Scentbird for sponsoring this video. Use code Dana Perez to save 55% off your first month at Scentbird for just over eight dollars you can try out your next favorite luxury fragrance with that i hope you guys have a super awesome rest of the week and i will see you in the next one bye